girl Avialin back again with another video and I'm coming live to you. Oh, don't want my vagina out. I'm coming live to you on top of this big fat ass pile of clothes that I'm about to get rid of, hopefully. So stay tuned. If you haven't noticed by the title of this video, I'm getting rid of some clothes. This is unfortunately not all of my clothes. So these are all the clothes from my closet, as well as clothes that I just kind of throw over here because I don't have any more room for my clothes, which is actually the reason why I'm doing this video. A lot of my clothes don't fit me. So I was just like, what, what I think I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna throw everything on the bed, as I have done, and I'm just gonna try everything on, like literally everything on, because I feel like if I just hold it up and be like, oh yeah, this is cute, or this fits, or probably fits, it probably won't fit, and it probably won't look cute. There might be some clothes in here from like my high school, near my middle school days, so don't judge me, don't judge my clothes. I'm, I'm getting there, y'all. I'm trying to be a fashion guru. Give me some time. But before we get started with today's video, if you are not already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to my channel as well as turn on my notifications because I would hate for you guys to miss any of my videos. I am consistent now. <laughs> so you don't want to miss that. So it's 10, 11 right now. I'm hoping that we can have this finished by 12 o'clock. If not, then I guess we're pulling an all nighter. So see you then. So I just kind of had a little mini meltdown because I'm just thinking, how am I going to try on all these clothes? Why am I trying on all these clothes? So I think the best thing to do right now is to go through all of these and pick out clothes that I know I want and I know that I can still wear. I feel a little more motivated to get started because this is, this is a lot. A lot of the stuff from the top are like my jackets. Love it. Always love this jacket. It's odd future. It reminds me of The Simpsons, so that's definitely a keep. Why do I not see anything I want to keep? Hoodies are definitely a keep. I literally only wear hoodies every day. Ooh, Howard. <laughs> go Bison. You can never go wrong with a black skirt, you know? Might need that for church or something. Should I keep this? Is this cute? This is still doable. I think, I think this is kind of cute. This is why I'm cleaning out my closet. This is a whole Tommy Hilfiger jacket with the tag still on it. It's a little summer dress, it's cute, love it, gonna keep it. This, definite keep. Tommy Figger, uh, Tommy Hilfiger, bla uh, Tommy Hilfiger, Tommy Hilfiger blazer, definitely a keep. Oh my gosh, yes, definitely keeping this. So you guys, I had always wanted an Olympic jacket. I got the official polo Olympic jacket it was back when it was in rio it has like the usa with like brazil on the side love this jacket i barely wear it now because i don't know i just feel like it's gonna be worth something someday probably not because i've worn it but i'm gonna keep it tommy hilfiger jean dress mm, keep is this just like a sponsor for tommy hilfiger what the f if i pull out another tommy hilfiger outfit i'm not even gonna show the brand because they need to pay me something for all these clothes that i have Tommy Hilfiger sweater. Actually, I'm gonna keep this. Should I keep this? Just a plain black jacket. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna keep it. Oh, yet again, another Tommy Hilfiger. You know what? I'm just gonna embrace the fact that I really just like Tommy Hilfiger brand. I didn't even know that I had this many Tommy Hilfiger clothes. Like, literally, here's a blazer. Here's a Tommy Hilfiger dress. Like, should I be the spokesperson? I feel like I should be the spokesperson. I'm, it just makes sense, right? <laughs> I don't wanna try out all these clothes. <laughs> Ooh, okay. This, yeah, I'm gonna keep this. I'm glad, actually glad that I tried this on. I, ooh, love a good pea coat. Definitely not getting rid of this. Don't know if I wanna keep this jacket. So it doesn't give me like the puffy jacket vibe that I want, like. This is another Korean sweater. I just like kind of let my parents pass down their clothes to me, like both my mom and my dad, because I'm too lazy to go out and buy my own clothes. But I love like the vintage look. I love the sweater look. Oh no. This is such an ugly skirt. I have absolutely no idea what I would do with this. Why did I say I was gonna try on all these clothes? I don't know why I committed to that. 
Okay, I'm gonna go see what this looks like. I'll be right back. Oh, okay guys, so this actually might be the first thing that I don't keep. The black is faded, the colors are faded. So anytime that we're gonna retire clothing, I'm just gonna throw it. I'm a Kobe it. Oh, rest in peace, Kobe Bryant. Sorry, camera number two. If I hit you, you are a camera. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. So, cute skirt, love it. You can never go wrong, it's like a little like fleece jacket. I feel like I haven't made any progress. I've only gotten rid of one piece of clothing, so I don't feel super good about this anymore. Whoa. Oh, oh, this is cute. Oh, this is really cute. And I'm gonna, this still has the tag on it too. I'm definitely gonna keep this. It's literally been 40 minutes since I started filming and this is taking forever. Actually, I like this, I like this sweater. I don't know if you can tell, but it has like the TH, but I'm also just like, this kind of looks like an old woman's sweater. I feel like I can like give this to my mom. Got that Tommy Hill figure with the crest, like I'm Spencer from Pretty Little Liars. You love it. When I started watching Pretty Little Liars, I don't know, I just kind of fell in love with her style. I know y'all know what I'm talking about, like that prep girl, like, I have to sneak around the catacombs of the school to discover the hidden janitor's motive type clothes. TH dress, love it. Like, honestly, it goes really well with my skin. Oh, I gotta try this on. I do not wanna try this on. <laughs> oh no, I do not like this. I'm glad I tried this on. I don't care that it still has a tag on it. It is not staying in the closet. No, no. I'm actually trying on more clothes that I'm showing you guys and I'm starting to get really, really hot from all this taking clothes on and taking clothes off. So if I start sweating, uh, just ignore that. You know what I feel like when I really am gonna start getting rid of clothes? When I get to my dresser, like, you guys can't see it and I'll insert a little video, but like, my dresser has a majority of the clothes that I actually touch. Like, my closet, I don't really touch a lot of those clothes unless like, like I need a jacket or I'm drying clothes, but this is going to be the bulk of the video. I feel like everything on the bed, it just needs organizing more so than it needed purging. So, we're organizing right now which is okay. Oh, this is an oldie. No, no. Not even gonna talk about it. Don't want it. Yeah, keep. Thigh is completely torn. I think it's time to put these pants to rest. And honestly, I'm not even gonna give them away. I'm just gonna throw them away because they're garbage. So this is the garbage pile. So as you can see, it has like the little, like it like cuts down on the boobs, like the titty, so you get a little titty action. Yeah, you see that back action, girl. Yeah, yeah. that's nice. That's real nice. Oh, my camera battery is dying. That's not good. So yeah, I think with that being said, I'm gonna go to bed. Meet you guys in the morning to finish this pile, and by the morning I mean when I get off work. So I'll see you then. Okay, I'm back. I'm back everybody. I am back from work. It is a new day if you can't tell by the light coming in from my window. It is the next morning. It's currently 3.30 in the afternoon. So I'm gonna get into something a little more comfortable and we can get back to the pile. Cause we still have this and my drawers to do. So let's get started. All right, <laughs> I, I can do this. You know, a little hoodie action. Love it. So I'm just gonna jump back into this pile of clothes. I don't want to <laughs> I had to sleep next to this pile of clothes last night. Do you know how hot it gets near a huge mound of clothes? So how are you guys doing? Like, I feel like I'm doing all the talking, you know? Like, I just want to know how you guys are. Like, how's, how's life? How's, how's the kids if you have kids okay is this blood did someone drip blood on my shirt what what is this oh my god love a good peacoat yes and she's black we love to see it yes right oh this is literally one of my favorite dresses to wear look at this y'all it's so pretty it's like the sleeves are see-through and the end is like embroidered or whatever whatever this is called when it's like sparkly like this. If this is a 16, it's way, way too big for me now. I am gonna let this go just because I do need more dress clothes and I keep trying to hold on to old ones, but like, I need new dress clothes. It's time for a new look of professionalism, okay? I need that. 
Ooh, Pony Gang. <laughs> Love that. This was one of my favorite polo shirts, y'all, because it was actually the polo shirt that was in color, like with the little horse man on it. So, as much as I love this, wait, can I fit this? I'm gonna try this on because I feel like I might be able to wear this still. Hold up. So, yeah, this is gonna have to go too. Oh, God, another ugly dress. What even is this monster? Oh, my God. Get out of here. Get out of here. Never talk to me or my clothes ever again. Don't want this. She has to go. She's just a little too faded for your girl. You know, it's a new day. It's a new me. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling refreshed. So we're moving. We're really moving. I don't know. I wear this top a lot and without the skirt. And I really, really like it. And I don't want to get rid of it. So I think I'm, uh, I'm going to keep her. I'm definitely going to keep her. If you remember this dress, this was the dress that I wore to my welcome to my channel video i i'll insert a little bit of that right here wow i was like so excited that's like when i actually used to like beat my face and do my hair every time i filmed a video Ooh, another cute skirt i actually have so many cute clothes like why do i only wear like hoodies and sweatshirts every day with leggings i i have so many cute freaking clothes i don't get it i love this kimono but it's ripped can i fix it i don't think i can fix that you can never go wrong with a little black dress. Like, honestly, if you don't have a little black dress, ladies, what you doing? Like, you never know when you need to stun on these girls with a black dress. You gotta keep it prepared. You got to keep it in your closet, period. All right, that's, uh, Everything but the underwear drawer. <laughs> I almost fell off the bed. Oh God. Okay, don't do that. I don't recommend doing that ever again. Our pile is not as big as before, but it's a doable pile. And like I said, a lot of things in this pile are just like miscellaneous clothes. I'm pull while I was pulling it out, I already see like a bunch of stuff that I want to get rid of. So, uh, yeah, let's get it cracking. So I did the YouTube Black Fan Fest back in 2018 at Howard University. It was an amazing experience. I met so many different creators. I think it's time to retire these cute little pants. I really do. Had a great time with them though. Oh, oh God, these are worth some thotty joints for real. I call these the, th the thotty joints. <laughs> if you have these, I'm sorry, I'm not calling you a thought, but these on my ass, Oh yeah, these thotty joints. <laughs> wow, I remember this, never wore it. I like the way it, it just didn't look right on my boobs. Like, it made me look like I worked in a bar back in the medieval times and I was serving like chicken legs and, and grog to Vikings. Like, it just, <laughs> that's what I think about when I put that on. I don't want you anymore. I just hit at a ring light too. Wow, and I'm also doing a lot of cussing in this video. I should really slow it down. I'm sorry guys. This is this is a family friendly channel. <laughs> I'm lying. I'm lying. This is not family friendly at all. Sorry. If you if you got kids, don't let them don't let them watch my videos. What? How do you, how do you put this on? Oh, I'm just dumb. Okay. My head is in the armhole. I love this. It's Calvin Klein. Wow, not surprised. You know what? You know what? Can I wear this? It's. I know it's going to be big on me. It's always big on me, but it's always such a look when I wear it. Like, it's one of those, like, your man just got home and all you're wearing is his t-shirt his big t-shirt with no panties on whoa uh, not panties uh with no pants on i like this i'm gonna keep this i'm gonna keep this and I, I need to find a man that i can wear that for now i don't dress like this anymore um i never really dress like this all the time but this is a nice shirt i think i'm gonna keep this like you see this like oh my hands are a little ashy let me back up <laughs> Yeah, that's hot. I know you like that. I like. I know you like the way my shirt snapped. Boy. Oh, oh. 
y'all tommy hilfiger we went crazy with the hilfiger y'all like i think tommy hilfiger and polo is the most of what i have so everything left on the pile here is just like shorts or like towels like pajama pants socks so i'm not too worried about this stuff like i know all this stuff i'm gonna keep but we have sorted through the bulk of everything so, all right guys so that was our 2020 purge of our clothes reboot closet organization whatever you want to call it thank you guys so much for sticking to the end i really do appreciate it if you like this video make sure to give it a huge thumbs up as well as subscribe so when you hit that subscribe button make sure you hit that notification bell too because youtube does not always let you guys know what i post and i would hate for y'all to miss the next video thank you so much for watching you guys stay tight and i'll catch you another late night bye did you